Hello, and welcome to another lesson on the Arc Development Kit. Today, I will be covering the weather or daylight system. It's actually going to be a really easy lesson because we're just going to copy and we're going to paste it from the main map. That way, we'll make sure that we have the exact same settings and that everything is going to be fine. So, what you're first gonna, going to do is you're going to go to your maps, the island sub maps, and you're going to load up the island. If it's your first time, it's going to take about 40 minutes and then probably another 10 minutes of compiling just sit through it you're gonna have to do it anyway at some point um, so yeah just do it then at the very bottom is where we're going to start you're gonna make sure you're gonna select the weather global outdoor fog and the wind directional source then we're gonna scroll up a little bit and then you will find these three dynamic capture managers make sure you get those then we're gonna actually scroll up a lot we're gonna go past all the player spawns go go further 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 and boom here's where we're gonna hit it the day weather you're just gonna copy these as well so just select them all keep it going keep it going you're doing great and uh, once we've got them all selected we're just gonna hit control C or right click edit copy then we're gonna go over to our own map load that one up and now you're just gonna click somewhere hit control V and there you'll see everything will be pasting in I already had it set up so it's gonna paste again for me but um, that is basically it as I can see we forgot the ambient global rain sound and the ambient global wind sound they are probably at the very top of all the of the hierarchy and um, if you are not sure if you're uh, let me see where is it if the blueprint sky sphere is the same then just make sure you have your directional light actually linked to your uh, blueprint as well as the day cycle manager that we just copied here you're gonna have to put that over there then your sun height should be on minus one and the actor hitting game should also be ticked for the rest you're good to go and uh, you have now successfully implemented a daylight system into your map congratulations if you have any questions or comments you can post them in the comment section below I have not too many knowledge on this subject so I might not be able to answer them anyway have a nice day